My dear students, welcome to week one in our English language arts uh, classes. Our first unit is generations. Um, we're going to answer questions like, what have you learned from people who are more than 20 years older than you? Were these lessons valuable? In 20 years, will you be teaching a teenager the same things? Why and why not? Um, this unit is a great unit that connects between generations and that show that young people often learn from older people, but sometimes it works the other way around. In this unit, we will have the key concept, which is going to be perspectives and point of view and character as related concepts. And we are going to explore identities and relationships, identity formation and role modeling as the global context of this unit. As for the statement of inquiry for this unit, it's going to be a character's identity formation and perspective may change when generating new relationships. We're going to answer three kinds of questions, factual questions, conceptual questions, and a debatable question. As for the factual questions, we're going to find out what are the character traits, what are character motives, and what is perspective? What can one generation learn from the other? What is a point of view, and what point of view would an author use to write a story? As for the conceptual, we're going to discover how can your social connection strengthen your character? How is your perspective influenced by the older generation in your society? How does the character's identity formation and perspective change when generating new relationships? As for the debatable question, we're going to debate to what extent would a teenager still be influenced by someone who's 20 years older in the future. For the summative assessment, you will be asked to write a nonfiction narrative about the influence someone from a different generation has had on you or someone you know. Now let's talk about um, our week breakdown. On day one, we will, uh, we will get to know each other. We will have icebreaker activities. On day two, we are going to discuss the regulations and we are going to have the unit introduction, the unit components, the summative requirements, and so on. On day three, we, were, we are going to start with the launch text, grounded, and we are going to write a summary. On day four, we are going to start with two kinds. Two Kinds is a great short story. We will read for main idea and concept vocabulary, and you will take useful notes within the class. On day five, we are going to continue with Two Kinds, but this time we're going to read for character analysis. We're go we are going to analyze uh, the character traits, the character's motives, how they react throughout the story, to try to understand more about them. And we are going to explore the author's point of view. Why did the author use that certain point of view? Thank you very much. I can't wait to start this week. This is your teacher, Dima Bouchard.